Hi, this is Chris Neitzer, and this is part three of four in the text editor. In this video, I'll be discussing creating links in the text editor. So once again, to get started, go ahead and click on the open edit pages module. And I'm going to be editing my resume again. To edit text in the text editor, go ahead and click on the text in the grid. And this brings us back to the text editor. Before we get started, I just want to note that links can be created from text and images as well. To make your text into a link, simply highlight some text, and then click on the Insert Edit Link button. And this will bring up the Insert Edit Link menu in the text editor. From here, you can create five different types of links. You can link to another page on your website by clicking on the page in this drop down menu. You can link to another file on your website again by clicking on this drop down menu. Note that you have to upload the file first before you can link to it. Also, you can link to an anchor. Anchor links link you to another point on the same page that you're on. You can also link to an external website here, or you can link to an email address. For this, I'm going to link to an external website. When creating a link, you have the option of opening it in the same window, or you can open it in a new window. If your website uses frames, you can open it in a specific frame as well. I'm going to leave this option alone and have it open in the same window. So once you've inputted the information for your link, go ahead and click Insert. Now this piece of text has been converted into a link. As I mentioned before, you can also link an image. To do that, select the image, and again, click the Insert Link button. This time I'm going to make it an email address. Once you've inputted the email address, click Insert. And now this image links to my email address. So when you click on it on my page, it opens your email client and allows you to send me an email. So once you've finished, click Update. And I'm going to preview the page. So this is our page. If I click on the image, it'll bring me to my email client and allow me to send a message. My text link has also been created here. If I click on it, it takes me straight to the website that I specified in the text editor. That's it for part 3 of the text editor video. In the next video, I'll be talking about using tables in the text editor.